Hi, my name is April Kedron. I'm a kindergarten teacher at Point Elementary. This is an exciting time as you prepare for your child to enter kindergarten in the fall. I'm going to give you some strategies to use as you do read alouds with your child at home. Reading daily to your child helps promote a love for reading and it helps develop those early language skills that are so important. Try and find a time each day to read aloud to your child. It can be after dinner, before bed, any time during the day that works with your schedule. As you pick out a book that you want to read, or as your child picks out a book that they would like to hear, you want to talk about the title, you want to talk about the author of the story, and then talk about the picture on the story and how that's going to match the title, and it's going to match what's happening in the story. As you're reading the story, allow your child to help you turn the pages. That way they can see how the book is actually going to work, and then they can see how we're reading from the left to the right of the book. Make predictions about what's gonna happen in the story. So, as you talk about the picture on the front of the story, talk about what's going to happen in the story. As you read the story, talk about what's going to happen next. And then whenever you get to the end of the story, talk about whether those predictions were right, whether they happened, or whether they didn't happen. It's so important whenever you're reading to use expression to keep your child's attention and to keep them engaged in the story. So, talk like the characters in the story and use funny faces. You can use sound effects, use gestures, change the pitch of your voice, whatever you can do to keep them engaged. You wanna encourage your child to participate in the story. So, so many picture books have repeated phrases, familiar songs, the same patterns throughout the story, and you wanna allow your child to participate in those stories. So if every other page has the same sentence on it, maybe you'll get to the point where your child is saying that same sentence, and that helps keep them engaged in the story as well. Discuss rhyming words whenever you come to them. So talk about what is a rhyming word and how do these words rhyme? Allow them to come up with some words that rhyme as well. Give them a sentence and let them see if they can finish the sentence with the rhyming words. So example, the cat is wearing a funny, see if they can figure out what's gonna go at the end of that story. When you're done reading, just discuss what happened in the story. So talk about who was the character? What happened at the beginning of the story? How did the story end? So many times kids find a book that they love and they just wanna read it over and over and over again. No worries let them read that same book over and over again. There's so many benefits to reading the same stories over and over and over again. They're gonna to get to the point where they can tell you the story and they can tell you what's happening in the story. I hope you have a great summer and we can't wait to get to know you and your child this fall in kindergarten.